How are we doing, fellas? Girls, guys and girls. Right. I don't know why I'm not at home. I got one of these early on in the end. Uh, well, a few weeks ago, a month or so ago. Very nice indeed. Doesn't come in any crew. One of the Israeli ones does, but this one doesn't. So I thought, right. I've had Redux crew before. Um, they're pretty damn good. What can I get for this? Well, put that out of the way. What about these? Uh, these are on Facebook. R2 miniatures. On the 35th, 3D printed Apache pilots for the US Army. <coughs> now they come in a, a, a fairly biggish box. This thing's in, sitting in the middle of it. And then when you open this up, it's got all this wool in there. And then the guys are in these packets with their their, their bits. So we're taking this one out and we'll take the other one out. Just so we don't have to top her around with things. So here they are. A pair of them. <coughs> and my god. Just look at them. They're a bit of a quirky colour, but you know, it pretty much highlights all the detail on them. Absolutely exquisite detail. I mean, look at it down to the little leads, the seat restraint straps. And I thought to myself, you know, even that look, the little hole in his visor. The other one's got a bit blurred. And that the eye monocle. Warren for now, we're into the battery pack on the back and the general outlook of him. Marvellous, and then you get the other one. I presume this one's the pilot. <coughs> but uh, outstanding detail, really is. Yeah, I mean, look at that. What he's crash at. When you get to these, it's kind of reached another level, I think. These are the first I've had from R2. And I'm blown away just with these two. <clears throat> um, I can't remember uh, what it is now that the other bits and bobs and pilots they do but just these alone is um is yeah unbelievable I mean, look. Yeah, amazing Unbelievable. And they fit perfect in the seats that go into that Meng helicopter. And, you know, that's quite a summit. I mean, a lot of it years ago, used to get pilots and they never sat in the seat well, or they look too short, too tall, parachute might have been too big in some of the World War II stuff. But these absolutely fit like a dream. I'll put them in there. I'll see if I can get the seat out of the box. <coughs> uh, where is it? It's in that bag there. Get rid of that chunk of great thing. Yeah, there it is. <coughs> I 
Right, so... Ew. So we've got the seat. Um, there's no cushions on this at the moment, so, you know, but just to say that... Um, Take the thing out his ass and goes in there like that. So there he is in the chair with the belts going through the correct hole that it's supposed to go through. So you can see the gaps just right for the cushion on on the seat at the bottom. So where the where the cushion's going to go is there. So when they go in, there's enough gap there. Uh, the back, I don't I see if there is, there is a back one, then it'll have that as well. The gap's right. So, I mean, there you go. And then he sits in there. Like that. Where do I get this? He's in chairs in so yeah you sit in there like that absolutely bloody amazing really is the only thing is is like his hand doesn't quite touch the stick um you know but i'm pretty sure that can be sorted <coughs> in one way or another and just glue the stick into his hand Chopped off at the bottom, unless he sits, and this is as a front bloke, I don't know which one's which. It's pretty quite honest with really. me. No, he's not. Although he's got his hand on the, supposed to have his hand on the cyclic, and then his hand on the joystick, but the joystick's even smaller in the bloody, on the front one. So I don't know. But either way, he sits in there and he's looking cool. So there we go. So that's, uh, that's the R2 Miniatures Pilots with the Meng Apache, that's what they're for, the Meng Apache helicopter. So that made me mind up whether I'm going to do that airborne D or whether to um, put the upgraded exhaust on it, the tacking kit, and um, use a few other bits and, and do something else. But uh, I don't know yet. Probably might just leave it as is and then see if I can get the Tack and Warrior kit and go from there. Because uh, then I won't have to mess about so much then. <coughs> <coughs> right. Well, without further ado, let's put them back in their box. And there they are. R2 miniatures, 135th pilots for the Apache, the Meng Apache. Take it easy, like and subscribe. See you in the next one.